Hello, I'm Rebecca Barnes, and welcome to the Science at ESA vodcast. With eyes that peer into the most energetic phenomena in the cosmos, ESA's XMM Newton and Integral Space Observatories have been setting records, discovering the unexpected, and helping to further our understanding of the unknown universe. In visible light, the star-forming region of the Orion Nebula is a beautiful cloud of gas and dust. When XMM Newton looked into this cloud, it discovered a huge area of extremely hot plasma revealed in X-rays. A supernova marking the death of a massive star can be bright enough to briefly outshine an entire galaxy. These explosions eject the outer layers of the star into the surrounding space, causing powerful shock waves. XMM Newton made the first detection of two bright iron lines in the X-ray spectrum from a supermassive black hole lurking at the center of a distant active galaxy. X-rays are produced as matter is drawn onto the disk surrounding the black hole and from reflection by the disk material. By studying the varying brightness of the iron lines and that of the direct X-ray emission, astronomers observed a lag time between the variations. Using data from Integral, astronomers have identified a particular radioactive isotope of aluminium that is produced in massive stars and released into space by stellar winds or supernova. Integral's wide field of view can be used to study the entire region at the center of our galaxy at one time. This region, known as the galactic bulge, is rich in bright, variable X-ray and gamma-ray sources. Supermassive black holes have been seen by Integral, lurking in many galaxies. When galaxies closer to our own were searched, surprisingly few black holes were found. These really are just a small taster of the celestial wonders previously hidden to astronomers and revealed by these remarkable space observatories. XMM Newton and Integral will continue to keep watch on the ever-changing high-energy X-ray and gamma-ray universe, react to sudden, violent outbursts and help to solve mysteries of the cosmos. I'm Rebecca Barnes. Thank you for watching the Science at ESA vodcast.